friends, we are going to go ahead and roll that beautiful bean footage, also known as the credits. Do you absolutely positively love products by Soap Lady Z? That could be our soap. That could be our books. That could be our classes. That could just be our gratitude and our show. Make sure you sign up for our ambassador program today and you earn money for your referrals to Soap Nation. How cool is that? Now, you may also be wondering, how can you easily support Soap Lady Z? Like the videos. Were you watching? Did you tap the screen? Did you send an emoji? Did you put a thumbs up? That is supporting the broadcast. You can share it with your friends on social media. Make sure you're following my channel on Instagram, Facebook, YouTube, Twitter, anywhere in the social media land that you are actually hearing the sound of my voice. Make sure you have clicked that follow button and make sure you also subscribe to my email list so that you can stay connected. And most importantly, thumbs do matter. Rate and review wherever you are. If there's an option to put a comment, put a comment in there. Now, did you see something that you've just got to have it? Did I make something live that you're like, oh, yes, I'm getting it. I need it for my skin. I need to learn. Any of those things. Naturalsoapbyzakia.com is where you can go to get all of my handmade products. These make excellent gifts for friends, family, and co-workers. Some of my absolute best-selling products are the Triple Butter Blend, the Activated Charcoal and Kale and Clay, as well as the Peppermint Soap. If you are looking for a gift that actually keeps on giving, subscribe to my Soap of the Month Club and you actually get bath treats delivered to your door each and every month. Head over to naturalsoapbyzakia.com to place your order today. Not tomorrow, not a little bit later. Do it now. It's handmade, guys. Doesn't last forever. When it's gone, it's gone until I make it again. Get your order in today. Now, do you actually want to make your own handmade soap from scratch? Who wouldn't? Who wouldn't? It's so calming. It's so soothing and you actually control all of the ingredients. Check out the new Soap Makers Cookbook series available both in paperback and ebook format exclusively on Amazon.com. Oh yeah. Head to bit.ly forward slash soap books and you can see my author page as well as all of the books and the reviews and order your copy today but if you're like a lot of people you actually want to sit and take a class because you want to learn and know that you know that you know that you know you can actually take a soap making class with soap lady z live or online visit livesoapschool.com forward slash classes for more information what's available as well as the schedule Head over there today if you would like to learn how to make your own soap from scratch. Thanks again for tuning in live or even on the replay. You guys are awesome too. Bubbles and hugs. And most importantly, don't forget to subscribe, like, comment, and share. Hey everybody, this is Zakia. Um, we do have two cameras going on. Um, that gave me a chance to get my goggles on. Um, my daughters and I went to the auto show today. Um, so welcome to the broadcast. Welcome to the broadcast. Greetings. Welcome to the broadcast. Um, greetings, Papa Bear Alaska. So if any of you are brand new to me, my name is Zakia. I make my own handmade natural soap and I typically do it from scratch. Hey, hey, Miss Frances. You've been trying to catch me on social media and I am finally here. I tried to do another broadcast right before this one, but for some reason, it was only showing on YouTube. It wasn't coming up here on Periscope, so I said I would go ahead and do it this way because this will save to my computer and then I can premiere it as a YouTube video for the people who aren't connected with me here on Periscope. So it'll work out very well. Saw that car show you shared. Oh my gosh. 
I saw work vans. Like my mind is thinking about how can I get this soap on wheels? Um, I'm so happy you've been very busy. So I'm actually going to switch you guys over to this screen because that way you actually get a better picture of the table, all of the things. My books are still messed up from the earlier broadcast. Let me fix that because you don't want to see the back of the book. Um, that way you can actually see the entire table and what we got going on. You kind of can't see the books. Let me get this in the right. Let me, let me fix that because it's kind of off. Hold on. Get that here. Pull them back. And this is where the joy of editing for YouTube is going to come in. Perfect. I see those there. What we have on the table are the oils. We also have our molds that we are going to be using. We also have all of our bowls over here that have the colors in them that we are going to be using. I am calling this soap a taste the rainbow soap because it is going to be scented in a tropical passion fruit fragrance. And I'm using a yellow. I only wear safety sunglasses, Papa. But you're in, every time I see somebody broadcasting from Alaska, although there's not a lot of you, it looks like the sun is beaming directly in your eyeball. So I can understand why you wear those kind. But because I'm using sodium hydroxide, I have my decked out, blinged out safety goggles here. And then that also encourages people to come into the periscope land. Now, I'm trying to figure out where would be my center on here. I think this is probably the center of the screen. We're using a yellow colorant, which you guys can't see, but it's not a whole lot of yellow. We're also using a teal blue colorant. And then we're also using a hot pink. And as you can see, there's not a whole lot in there. I may need to add a little bit more. I may need to add a little bit more. And then also white. And this should not take very long to do. So what I'm going to do is grab our lie over here. Paige, you got to be quieter. Because I'm competing with you screaming. No, I mean like I don't want to be able to hear you. Church mouse. Church mouse. I mean church mouse. You are censored. Yes, like that is perfect. Thank you. Alrighty. So you guys have seen this process a time or two if you have been with me before. Um, if you have not been with me before, this is always the exciting part because we never know what's going to happen. <laughs> we never know if the soap is going to cooperate or not. And so I have these molds. I lined them, but I did not have scissors to get them lined perfectly. So I actually have binder clips that are holding the parchment paper in place. So we're hoping that that will actually go very well for what we're trying to do. These were solid oils in here. So this had um, cocoa butter, coconut oil, and palm oil. So these have been melted down. And to that, I'm going to add the liquid oils right here. Yeah, you guys can't see inside the pot. Sorry about that. But once we go to pour it, you should be okay. Paige, what did I ask you? Are you doing that? Okay, let's try again, okay? Thank you. All right, so what we're calling this Taste the Rainbow because of the colors that we're going to have in here. And then we're also calling it that because it's going to smell, hopefully, like a rainbow. Let me see. It looks okay. I'm making sure. Is the sound coming across okay, guys? I can't hear the sound because I have to have you muted. Otherwise, I'll have an echo. But is the sound coming through? Let me see. I know there's a delay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. That's a long delay. Hold on. That means you can't hear. Hold on, guys. We make good. Yeah. Oh, wow. That is a very long delay. Okay. Oh, that's 
That's concerning, but you guys told me that you could hear, so that's good to go. All right, I'm going to go ahead and add in our lye. It's already mixing, mixing. And this has been sitting since this morning on our first broadcast earlier today. And so what I'm doing, you guys, I'm going to look for somebody to say stop blending because I keep on saying I'm going to just blend it to a light emulsion oh you guys can't see you'll see it when I pour it <laughs> we can hear think by rain a light light emulsion but it has to be blended Ten second delay, but sounds good, and I am censored. Thank you. There is a little pole right here in the middle, which is definitely right in the center. But you know, I have a little bit more hanging out on that side than I do on that side. So it kind of, whatever. You guys will see. <laughs> you will definitely see. Who just ordered on the website? Are you in here? Welcome and thank you for your order if you're here. Yeah, here we go again. I have a problem with blending, guys. I blend too long. You really should not need to blend all that long. And I just take it too far. I take it too far, but soap can be forgiving or it can be very evil. Put that there for now. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to just separate it into a few colors. So first that teal. Right there. Then we're going to go with the yellow. And I'm going to need a new tablecloth. Stat. And then the pink. And I don't need a whole lot of pink. I just want a little bit of an accent for that pink. Akia Falaga, welcome to the broadcast. Oh boy. I needed a little bit more for the white. We shall see how this goes. I know what I can do. Hold on, guys. I didn't need that much for yellow. I need more for my white. Paige. <laughs> she loves them. Hmm. Good thing I hadn't blended that up yet. Well, say excuse me, nasty. Well, maybe that blue is going to end up being our base. Well, you're the one who said I poured it. If you guys could see the mess that I'm making on this table back here, I wish I still had my plastic on, but I took it off. And then hopefully you'll be able to see this blue. That might work. Or I might need to add some more blue. I don't know who that is. Hello there. Welcome to the broadcast. It's saying it's your very first day on Periscope. Hoping you enjoy the platform. I think this will be our base color. And the white, the yellow, and the pink will be accents. This is like almost a Tiffany teal blue. You guys can't see it that well. Let's bring it up. <laughs> Welcome all newcomers. Thank you to Zakia at Natural. Thank you so much. All right, so I'm just blending this here. I did go a little heavy with the stick blender. Didn't need to go that long. And we're going to switch. I was going to make white our base color for this soap. But I think I'm going to go with this teal blue. So sometimes mistakes are good. Oh, Miss Francis, that was a bot repeating after you. 
That's always the test of time to make sure that this is going to behave. Oh my, now this smells like a bag of Skittles. <laughs> when I poured that in there, I don't know if you've ever like just opened a bag of Skittles, but that's what I'm smelling when I poured that scent in here. Mmm, it's a, a nice fruity scent. I'll say that for sure. Paige, do you think that's quiet? Nope. Not even a little bit. Uh, yes, it is. All right, we got this one. And so you can see it's a pretty thick consistency. So I should kind of get moving, but I can still see some of that color in there. That's not completely mixed, so I'm going to make sure that it's all mixed together. And if you are watching this on YouTube and you're wondering where that sound came from, I have a four-year-old that likes to play with her imagination and her toys. And that involves a little bit of yelling. All right. There's that one. I'm going to try and pour these two pretty even Steven. Trying is the operative word there. Okay, it's there. I'm trying not to get it along the sides because I don't want that to be in the soap. But I'm going to save some. Um, and once me, how many pounds of soap is this? This is 12 pounds of soap. Um, both of these molds hold six pounds. And so that's a great question. All right, I'm gonna set that off and we'll use that for the topper. I swiped myself right on up because you're tapping like a mad woman. Thank you for tapping the screen. I know we hashtag we love Paige. <laughs> well, that's because you guys have kind of seen her. They said they like you a little bit. They said they like you a little bit. They said they like me a little bit. Oh shoot, this has the pink in there. You guys, I was about to make a big old mess. I was about to make a big old, big old, big old mess. See? Let's get that out. We're going to make that our white. Where's my spatula? I'm going to add this into the pink. Guys, I was about to talk to A-L-E-X-A -E a minute ago. I was about to say something to her, then I realized, no, they're going to block your video, girl. Don't do it. <laughs> yes, they will. All right, let's get our white. Miss Francis, I see you with that purple heart. Thank you so much for tapping there. So what I'm doing now, guys, is I'm trying to make sure my titanium dioxide is blended well to avoid getting any rivers in my soap. I'm going to use my stick blender. Hey, Claudia. to take it from that natural yellow color to the white. Well, 
without splashing too much on the tablecloth. Now we're going to add a little more of our scent in there without spilling it. The worst thing you could do is spill it like I just did. Hey, special, how are you? This is, if, if this all makes it into the mold, it's going to smell incredible. I'll tell you that much. I mean, without misbehaving. Hey, Zakia. Hey, Miss Page. I hear you, but I don't see you. <laughs> She's playing with her dolls right now. <laughs> now, I poured this a little high. I didn't leave myself a whole lot of wiggle room. So now I do have to use my spatula because the more I use this stick blender, the thicker it's going to get. You better listen. Hey there, Tammy. All right, let's get the. Okay, I'm trying to make sure I don't miss anything at the same time. All right, so that's ready. I'm going to pour that from a little high because it's probably setting up in here. And I'm going to do the same thing on the opposite side. All right, now let's grab our pink. Did you say my favorite color? I sure did. You said my pink color, you said my pink color. I not said my your... you said my pink color. You <laughs> said my pink color. <laughs> hey, Natalie, how are you? All right, now let me see. If I switch you guys to this camera. Oh, you can't see what I'm doing. I'll switch it back. Boom. Let's grab some more scent. If you are looking, thank you so much. Mary, thank you for the invite. All of you that are tapping, I'll talk to you as soon as I get this daggone soap poured. I promise. But if you've been with me on some of the previous broadcasts, you know that this soap starts to set up in any moment. I do love the way this blue and white are inside of the mold. I love how they're coming out. I wish I had just a touch of activated charcoal, like a black, to offset when I pour this pink and then the yellow. It's the only thing I would do differently. All right. Somebody said, it looked like you get a real workout. <laughs> yes, I do. Oh, you know what? I can use the white one for that. A real workout with my arm. So we're up to 20, folks. While I blend this, tell me who you are. You sell your soap? I do. I am the owner of Natural Soap by Zakia. I tell you more. When I don't have a blender, I want Boom. I sell my soap at naturalsoapbyzakia.com. The link is in my bio. All of the soaps that I sell, I typically make live right here on the air. So you get a chance to see 
that it is definitely handmade and not something that we're saying is handmade. And then it's like, <gasps> you've been bamboozled. Hey there, how are you? All right. So now, let's pour our pink. Now, I kind of just want this on one side. Not necessarily all the way through. So basically, the higher you pour, the deeper the soap will go in to the layer before it. Um, hey, Gemini Power, welcome to the broadcast. Good to see you on this sun, this fine Sunday evening, or whatever day you happen to be watching this broadcast. But while we're doing it live, it is definitely Sunday. Get some of that white. Hopefully I got enough white for the other side because we still got yellow to do. Ah. And you want to try and get it in your mold, not necessarily on your mold, but more so in the mold. Now I'm hoping that gives me a nice shade of purple too. Hello, I send you a friend request on Facebook. Can you please add me? What's the first letter of your first name? Because I get a ton of friend requests every day. And sometimes if I don't have a mutual friend with you, I don't accept it. All right, almost done, guys. We still got to do our yellow. Our yellow. And right in time, because that yellow is like, oh, you just want to have me sitting off to the side? Let's go ahead and thicken on up, why don't we? All right, so I'm just mixing this up to change the color. Joe, okay, Joe, gotcha. I definitely need my stick blender for this. All right, let me. Paige, I'm about to throw all of your barrettes in the trash. Why? Because you keep spilling them, girl. A ton of friend request one. That's great. No, it's not necessarily great because. I look for people who are supporters, and normally people who, I don't, there's a difference between lurkers and supporters. Some people want to know what you're doing, and some people want to know what you're doing. Hold on, guys. Or how you doing? All those stuff. Um, am I missing anything? Gemini Power, how are you? I don't think I've missed anything. That's definitely blended. I need to pay better attention to these dang Periscope notifications. Yeah, Periscope, their notifications are a little shady. Because a lot of times... They don't even go out when I go live or sometimes you mute them or whatever. So what we would then do is, uh-oh, Paige did something. Oh, dear God. Paige, that's not good. Stop! Go clean them up! <laughs> not out of the toilet. I'll get them out of there. She can't do that. All right. So let me finish stirring this. All right. 
Let's get this. I'm going to pour this yellow right on top, right down the middle. Now this one is going to have a lot more yellow because I definitely didn't pour as high on this side. All right, let's see. Yeah, more pink actually. I need more pink over here. Pink set. And a, what did I miss? Oh, thank you so much. I need to pay better attention. You are so, you're welcome. All right. This is definitely a taste the rainbow kind of situation we got going. I feel like I need another color. Here's the blue. So I'll throw that on there. And you can kind of see how those colors are blending together. Paige, you singing what? Or are you humming? It sounds like a song. Mmm. That looks so pretty, just like a rainbow. Yeah, when I was looking at the colors, I was like, well, what can I do? Um, for a rainbow and I said well why don't you just blend a couple of colors together um, because definitely the scent had me in the mindset of a rainbow the scent most definitely put me there to think about a rainbow and as you guys can see I didn't do any kind of swirling I'm just hoping that the way that I poured the soap is what is going to create any kind of swirl in the soap. Perfect for New Year. Yes. All right. Let me tap it. Definitely needs to be tapped. I like the top of this one because it has a lot more color to it. This one just feels like it's missing something. Oh, shoot. Mm. Um, I can't wait to see what we cut. Yes, this one should be. No, well, we'll do this one tomorrow or the next day. Probably the next day. Hmm. I feel like I need, like, I like the tops of this one, but I feel like. Is there a weight for the soap or blocks? So this particular loaf that we're looking at, it's supposedly a six pound. And I say supposedly because I, I did not fill it all the way to the brim. Um, but it can hold six pounds of soap. My bars of soap typically range between four and six ounces per bar. So it'll go from this really large block to more of a bar. Is ordered while you are in here as a kid. No, she sends you a bonus. Thank you. I gotta not waste this soap here, so. 
Let's get our blue. This kind of looks, or it reminds me of graffiti. A playful, a kid's playful graffiti. Like, you know, if you were a kid and you were playing in paint, all right, there's that one. And then I better leave it. All right. And my spoon. All right, I got to get rid of these gloves because I can't do anything because they're slippery. Very, very slippery. All right, one second, guys. Let me grab a spoon. Beautiful website. We'll definitely order some. My wife is so natural. She, thank you so much. All right, guys. So if you are just coming in, my name is Zakia. We just made a batch of my handmade soap. This is our Taste the Rainbow, only because I am using a tropical passion fruit fragrance. And it smells very, very fruity. And so when I was thinking about that, I said, well... The only thing I can do is put a whole bunch of color in there. It's kind of like a, I'm going to say like a, it's, well, it's called passion fruit, but it's a really sweet smell. I don't see the body wash from earlier on the website. Um, the lemon, I will put that on there tonight. Wow, we are up to 30,000 hearts on this broadcast. All of you that are tapping your screen, thank you so much. I'm going to take a picture so I can actually post it. I'm going to post that on um, Instagram. If you're not connected with me on Instagram, make sure that you do. Because what I'm going to do is take this picture. And that's going to become our thing for tomorrow. Hey, Edible Sins. All right. So if you were actually commenting, Miss Francis, Can't Sleep, Drea, Edible Sins, you're, now it's like exploding. Let me take a better picture because now it's a whole bunch of them coming up. Hold on. It's so pretty. I wish you got here. That way you guys can see it. Here, I'll show you what I'm seeing. I'm going to switch you over to the main camera. That's what I'm seeing on my screen. It's like exploding. Like with all the hearts that are going. Hey there. How are you? All right. Let's switch back. Hey, everybody. Hey, everybody. Welcome to the broadcast. I said, welcome to the broadcast. All right. Let's go back to this way. Great creative scope. Thank you. All right. So let me move these so that the soap can get kind of front and center. And possibly... Adjust the camera so you're actually looking at the soap. Oh boy, Paige. That didn't sound good at all. I'm wondering, how can I zoom? Huh. Maybe. Hold on. Sorry for my hand, guys. I'm going to have to move you. Let me do uh Come over. I'm going to move you so you can actually see the top of the soap. Let's go to main cam first. And then what I'll do is I shall switch you so that the soap camera is right there. Because I have it listed as overhead, but it's not necessarily overhead. This is how you this is how you become your own producer in the middle of the broadcast. Uh, hold on guys. 
A little more to the left, to the left, to the left. Everything you own in the box, to the left. All right, can I do picture in picture? No. Okay. Let's go to overhead. Boom! Look at that. Look at that sunshine. Mr. Sun. Sun. Mr. Golden Sun. All right. Let me make sure that's even. That's even. Now you can actually see the colors that we got. You're learning from... Oh, perfect. Perfect, perfect. It doesn't feel like... One side looks a little higher on that one. So I can actually get rid of my binder clips. Because we've done all the pouring that we're going to do. So there's no chance for it to go. So pretty. Thanks, Melissa. Um, there's no chance for this to actually go behind the paper. No, oh, there's always a chance. All right, so we got that. We got a little bit of yellow. That side is a lot more messy. So we're going to start on this side, and I'm just going to take my spoon and just do the same thing that I always do. I just take it, and I push it down, and what that does is it creates like a wave in the soap without disturbing the color too much, but you get all of the colors coming across. So I'm going to do the same thing on this side. Boom. Just like that. I see that? So it's kind of just giving it a wave. I really love the way that side comes across. Now we're going to go down the middle. And just keep going. Can you guys see that? Very, very pretty. I love the way that one came out. Let's do the other side. Now this one, we're going to get a whole lot more. We're going to get a whole lot more because that has more of the color than the white that is on this side over here. So I'm going to push down, do the same thing. Going for a kind of bigger waves. I don't want it as defined as the other side because there's so much color on this side and I actually want those colors to pop on the top yes looks great thanks guys all right Same thing, and I'm just going to take my spoon and just pat straight down the middle to give it a little bit of a texture on the top. I'm not seeing much of the white on this side, if any. I am thoroughly pleased with both of these. This will be my Wet Soap Wednesday picture this week. Let's see. So I want to do picture and picture. Oh, no, I can't do picture and picture. Let me see. Because when I do picture and picture, you guys are going to have to change your phone. Change your phone. Hold on. So we also want to bring this one on. There we go. Oh, I can be in the bottom. So depending on... Oh, I got to come back into Periscope. So I'm Zakia, and this is our taste 
the rainbow soap this one um i had a scent that i wanted to use because it smells really good it's a very intoxicating smell it's called tropical passion fruit let me come back on periscope make sure you can see it doesn't block any comments anywhere no we are good to go um so you can see with plenty of dishes for me to do we have got ourselves two more batches of soap and I have quite a bit more to do um, and I just really wanted to do something with some color which is why I ended up doing this particular batch tonight get you a couple of screenshots oh. here okay let me come off of here then we don't need picture in picture anymore get rid of the picture in picture the smell and imagine because I did the yellow or the yellow the lemon cake this morning for the scrub with this passion fruit uh, well I'm gonna have to get better screenshots because I didn't got soap all over my table I didn't got soap all over the table guys so that's not gonna be a clean screenshot but this is the passion fruit taste the rainbow one so let's see can I switch camera Let's go to the main cam. So I'm Zakia. I am the one who makes this soap. Some of you ask, well, how do we buy your soap? It's at naturalsoapbyzakia.com. Um, and this will be available on there very, very soon. And we will cut this in about 24 hours. It does have to sit for about 24 hours in order for it to get hard. And then it has to like sit and cure for a little while. As you can see, I do have my call-in number. Periscope has introduced a call-in. So if you would like to call into the broadcast, I'll give you like T-minus two minutes to call in. The only thing, make sure you are using a headset. If not, I will catch you guys. Well, actually, I can't even do a call-in. It's, it's Sunday. I got to get ready for the work week. But thank you all for joining me today as well as earlier. I'm going to say see you later. And I'm going to roll that beautiful bean footage. You want me to say hi? Thank you so much for joining today's live broadcast. And we're going to go ahead and roll that beautiful bean footage, also known as the credits. Do you absolutely positively love products by Soap Lady Z? That could be our soap. That could be our books. That could be our classes. That could just be our gratitude and our show. Make sure you sign up for our ambassador program today and you earn money for your referrals to Soap Nation. How cool is that? Now, you may also be wondering, how can you easily support Soap Lady Z? Like the videos. Were you watching? Did you tap the screen? Did you send an emoji? Did you put a thumbs up? That is supporting the broadcast. You can share it with your friends on social media. Make sure you're following my channel on Instagram, Facebook, YouTube, Twitter, anywhere in the social media land that you are actually hearing the sound of my voice. Make sure you have clicked that follow button and make sure you also subscribe to my email list so that you can stay connected. And most importantly, thumbs do matter. Rate and review wherever you are. If there's an option to put a comment, put a comment in there. Now, did you see something that you've just got to have it? Did I make something live that you're like, oh, yes, I'm getting it. I need it for my skin. I need to learn. Any of those things. Naturalsoapbyzakia.com is where you can go to get all of my handmade products. These make excellent gifts for friends, family, and co-workers. Some of my absolute best-selling products are the Triple Butter Blend, the Activated Charcoal and Kale and Clay, as well as the Peppermint Soap. If you are looking for a gift that actually keeps on giving, subscribe to my Soap of the Month Club and you actually get bath treats delivered to your door each and every month. Head over to naturalsoapbyzakia.com to place your order today. Not tomorrow, not a little bit later. Do it now. It's handmade, guys. Doesn't last forever. When it's gone, it's gone until I make it again. Get your order in today. Now, do you actually want to make your own handmade soap from scratch? Who wouldn't? 
who wouldn't? It's so calming. It's so soothing. And you actually control all of the ingredients. Check out the new Soap Makers Cookbook series available both in paperback and ebook format exclusively on Amazon.com. Oh, yeah. Head to bit.ly forward slash soap books and you can see my author page as well as all of the books and the reviews and order your copy today but if you're like a lot of people you actually want to sit and take a class because you want to learn and know that you know that you know that you know you can actually take a soap making class with soap lady z live or online Visit livesoapschool.com forward slash classes for more information, what's available, as well as the schedule. The schedule. The schedule. Head over there today if you would like to learn how to make your own soap from scratch. Thanks again for tuning in live or even on the replay. You guys are awesome too. Bubbles and hugs. And most importantly, Don't forget to subscribe, like, comment, and share.